Are you ready to take on the world swinging? I know I am. Let's get into it. What's up, YouTube? It's the Zebra Guy on my whole ever you want to know me as. Welcome back to another video. As you can see, we're going to take on the world swinging in the new Lord of the Fallen. We are playing this on the Xbox Series X because what better place to play it? Although there is, there is the other console, which I do own, so don't worry about that because it's where we got our content from. But before we do check out Lord of the Fallen, I want to say a massive thank you to Lurkit and the devs for providing the key for the purpose of this video. So I think this is either a sequel or a remake to the first um, Lord of the Fallen. I do have it on my ex. I do have it on the Xbox. I have the original one, but this is a newer version. I haven't checked it out, so this is a first look for the channel. So um, hopefully, I can get further than the bloody church because that first one really did do me in. So with that out of the way, let's go check it out. So we did take a break from um, doing stuff because I had to look after myself being injured and whatnot. Alright, that, that looks good enough. Alright. So let's have a look at this. So we do have the deluxe edition. So we've got a digital art book, a 3D gallery. Okay. We've got 3D photos. We don't have anything here. We don't have any pictures. All right, anyway, let's take out on the new game. I think, if I remember rightly, this is kind of like a, a Souls sort of game. If I remember rightly. The light vibration in the controller. Alright. Love the outfit. Absolutely fantastic. That was a dragon. We don't do dragons. No, no. Boris, forgive me. I'd steer this weapon of deliverance to a worthier servant than I. Going on, is he setting that on fire? Oh, jeez. You never possessed the metal for this crusade. I think he just got stabbed up. Why don't that's a creepy looking thing? Kind of reminds me of what Joker looks like in a, one of the comic books. Oh, Jesus. So, just so you know, this is not for the younger subscribers. This is definitely not for that. That was, that was brutal. All right. Female? All right, I didn't realize we were, um, a female character. Oh, 
is creepy, that light. Let's see what random does. Alright. So, random picking is always fun. The hair colour on that, the last previous one, is looks like the wrestler that I um, enjoy watching, Abaddon. I like the hair colour that I have. Oh, I like that. Yes. Trying to do a mix here. Just, we're just going to do random. Alright, I like that. Let's just do that. I'm not going to worry about... Alright. Character name. Um... Let's just do that. Because why not? We do randoms because you know there is an extensive part for the character creation but we have schedules so random always comes up with some wacky crap law the latest receiver of his grace great potential dwells within you doubtless for you to be chosen thusly and so does now Orius that looks like guide my hand a mixture of two subsequent boom. NK characters. Now if you have to work it out yourself, because I already have it in my head on who they look like, so I'm not gonna tell you guys. Your flesh has been made sacrosanct with the mark of the Dark Crusaders. Prove yourself worthy of this gift. All I'm saying is make his eyes glitter the and sparkle. Our work is of the greatest import. Graphics, that's not good. I'm not gonna lie, it looks like a fantastic game. So I'm gonna enjoy playing. Right, let's just get out of that. Okay. Okay, so we have some sort of light power. So, ferry. Hit. Oh, okay. Now, which way do we need to go? This way. Come at me, bro. Um, you good? That was fantastic. I like that. I don't think I could ever do that again. That was just perfect spin and top. That was awesome. Now I am definitely gonna um clip that. Get out of here. No, I didn't make another one spin. 
spot. We are gonna, um... Alright, so, oh, we can jump. I don't remember if we could jump in the last one. Well, that was, um... That was rubbish. I don't think I was meant to fall in the hole. No, I don't think I was meant to fall in the... Excuse me. Let's try that again. Right. Now we sprint. Oh, come on! We can't keep falling down there. There we go. Frickin' hole. Um, use B to dash quickly around the enemies, double tap, roll out of danger. Alright. Whoa! Inventory, press A to equip. We don't have anything else that we could equip there. We can throw a rock. Do we have any? No, we don't have anything else we can play with. All right. Um, where's my sword? Thank you. Yeah, take some of that. Right, I can't get up there, how? Hi. Would like to take that out. Alright, I'll have to take. Something else spinning. There we go. What was that? Not going to get points of umbral. Oh, that's cool. All right. Learning new things about this thing. 
all attacks will be combined with you. Combos, additionally melee stances can be switched. Alright. So you work better as a two-hander. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. Um, healing. by holding X to transition. I don't know why I'm... Let the umbral lamp. Okay, that's cool. That was... That's a lot of good mechanics in this game. I'm just knowing all these mechanics is going to be a bit of a difficult one. But There we go. Getting used to this. Raise mm -hmm. RT. Okay. There's definitely a lot to um. Definitely a lot to take in in this. get to that one but oh there's one here there's a lot to learn and it's um such an ingenious game See an enemy. Do we see an enemy here? Oh, there's one up there.
All right, I think I've got it. Let's go this way. The mechanics is definitely a lot. I'm not gonna lie. But, other than that... It doesn't seem this bad at all. I'm, I'm actually enjoying it. What are you? Okay. That was... That was something. Oh. people like this game like it's not my normal thing but I like it easy to take him out well not easy but you know what I mean a long period of oh, okay So we're out of that now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm I'm liking this. I'm not gonna be able to play much of it as I'm only temporarily back in the studio. There we go, thank you. What we're waiting for. I wonder if we actually can just drop down here. I think we can. No, no we can't. Gosh darn it. Let me get back down there. Can we go this way? All 
All right. Now, are we in the right place? This way, probably. You, mate. I'm gonna cut your head off. Right, so we were in a different dimension. See what we need to do. Oh wow. The scenery looks quite cool. I like that. Okay, this is just um a resting place. Upgrade the character, see if we can do that. Do we have any points? Yeah, we do. Alright. Alright, so we just upgraded, upgraded our strength. Alright. Let's take a rest here now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually liking this game. Graphics is good. Uh, gameplay complex is the controls to memorize all up here definitely is complex but it's not bad at all it's definitely something I would recommend like when I played the first one even that was a uh, complex itself but this I'm liking it I'm liking the way it is it's It's just good, it's set out better. Alright, let's block this. I think I just got knocked out. Yeah, I did. All right. Come out again. All right. So um, I'm gonna leave that there because I am gonna play more of this, but I do have other things on my schedule today. But the gameplay is. Definitely the complex um, part of it. Definitely um, Souls-like. So if you're into your Souls-like games, Lord of the Fallen is definitely something for that. But give me a second. So, here we go. So yeah, that was Lord of the Fallen. Lords of the Fallen. Definitely it's a Souls-like game. And it's... um, The atmosphere is dark, gothic. Sort of games I enjoy. Not the sort of games I've actually played a lot of. I did play Bloodborne, stuff like that. This has that absolute feel to it. <clears throat> Would I recommend it? Yes. I think it's on all platforms. So I think it's PC, PS5, Xbox. I have it on the um, Xbox Series X. Can't really play much more of it because I'm away from the studio. I'm only back temporarily at the moment. But would I ever recommend this game? Wholeheartedly, yes. Like I said, if you're into your Souls-like games, go for it. It's It's got what it needs. <coughs> it's got the gore. It's got the story. The, the main character looks fantastic. We do have the Deluxe Edition. So if you do have the Deluxe Edition, you will get the soundtrack. You'll get the art book. And the 3D model and photo. Something like that. I need to work that one out myself. 
but yeah, it's definitely worth the play. Go through the tutorial and the first entrance. We don't spoil the game on this channel. We get to a certain point and that's where we stop. So not to spoil it for other people. But with that said, I've enjoyed the game. I liked what I, liked what I saw. Might play a bit more before I have to leave again. But anyway, I want to say massive thank you to Lurkit and the devs for providing the key for the purpose of this video. I hope you enjoyed the game. It looks good if it's your type of game. Go grab it. Go have some fun. With that said, I've been the Zebra Guy, or might have everyone know me as. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in another video.